what is up y'all welcome and welcome back to my channel today we're going to be doing a hair video as y'all can see we got the hair swinging so it's time to get my little crusty dusty and dirty hair washed because it's been quite some time i think it's been about two weeks that i had this wash and go in and the remainder of the last half of this wash and go it was up in a bun or a ponytail so it's due time if you guys are new welcome my name is mara thank you guys so much for stopping by i do hope you guys like my channel i am trying to get back into the swing of things but you know life is a little crazy work is a little crazy but that is okay but anyways as you guys can see we are going in with some new products yes this is going to be a wash day routine or as close to a wash day routine as we can get now as y'all seen prior i am going to be using the cream of nature butter blend and flaxseed double duty elongate and define products again this is by cream of nature now y'all know that i love the cream of nature honey line that is one of my absolute favorites so i was like oh let me just grab one of these and yes look at my face the shampoo i loved it okay but i was in virginia one day and i was like let me just grab one of these one of these little sets because they didn't have it in store where i live if i live in new jersey if you guys do not know that and the products are very uh limited so i'm going in with the shampoo and i do two shampoo rounds or sessions whatever you guys want to call it i wash my hair twice with the shampoo and i also focus on my scalp because i have really bad product buildup so i just need to get all of the gel and all of the previous conditioner and leave-in conditioner whatever else is in my hair dirt and everything off of my scalp just so that way going into this styling routine i do pretty much have a clean slate so focus on your scalp and then the second wash that's when you go through the length of your hair All right, so as y'all can see, this is the second wash. I am focusing mainly on the length of my hair, but I am also getting back to my scalp as well, just to make sure that my scalp is as clean as I can get it because I do not want any surprises when I go to scratch my scalp in the middle of the week and I see some dirt underneath my nails. Okay, if you got dirt underneath your nails, you need to go back and do a little rewash. I scratch my scalp while I'm washing my hair the first time to see exactly how much dirt is, and conditioner and whatever else is left on my scalp. And that pretty much determine how much scrubbing I need to do on that second little wash round. And yes, we do use a massage brush to get that circulation and blood flow going to our scalp, going throughout our scalp. You know, blood circulation promotes hair growth. But I am now going with the Pantene Hair Repair Mask. Now, this is one of my favorite masks. I feel like y'all have seen it throughout my channel, throughout my videos. I am constantly grabbing this mask because as soon as you rinse it out, y'all, your hair is just feels like it's just slipping and sliding and gliding and everything. Like, going in, it feels like butter. Your hair will feel moisturized. And like I said, it just creates that slip that you need in order to detangle it properly. And it's really moisturizing, especially for natural hair, which I'm kind of surprised because it's Pantene, but it's also, I guess, formulated for natural hair. So that is always a plus. Now the detangling, it's obviously up to you. Some people, they do prefer to do finger detangling. I tried that and that does not work for me unless I brush my hair first to make sure that all of the tangles are removed, all of the knots are gone, and that I am able to slide and glide my fingers throughout my hair without it getting caught on anything and i also like my hair to be as smooth as possible when i do a wash and go as well just because that way it gets more defined and i feel like you can't get your hair smooth if you're just only finger detangling so i do go in with a brush and then when i need to help clump my hair after applying the gel then i'll just go in with my fingers All right, so now that we have our head detangled, I'm just gonna go in with the rinse out or leave in conditioner. Like the bottle says, you can either leave it in or you can rinse it out. There is no leave in conditioner only product. So it's just this and it's completely up to you how you wanna do it. But I am just gonna leave it in like a regular leave in conditioner and then I'm gonna go right into the styling.
All right, y'all, so this is where things start to go downhill. So as you guys can see, I grabbed that curl pudding and I had every intention of doing a wash and go, but look at that, stiff wear, stiff wear, okay. Um, so I had every intention of doing a wash go with that curl pudding. It said you can use the curl pudding and then you go in with the jelly. Now that curl pudding, it was pretty thick. So I was like, oh, it's going to have a real good hold. We're going to have some definition and curls is going to be on and popping. Okay. Um, I quickly got bamboozled and you will see in five, four, three, two, one. Like, look at my face. <gasps> Now after I seen I was about to get let down by that curl pudding, I put all of my faith into the hair jelly. Now y'all, the hair jelly going onto your hair, it feels amazing. It creates slip, but you gotta work. It, it makes you work, okay? Now as you guys can see, I do my little slickly slick method, try to get my hair shingled and curled and defined, but that, that wasn't working. So I was like, maybe I need to do smaller sections, try to work it that way, and the roots just was not... It, it wasn't no it wasn't holding the roots was going crazy the roots were rooting okay all right you're pivoting we are gonna pivot what i have in mind here so i had to scratch the idea of a wash and go but i was like let me let me press on and continue with these products let me see if they can work with another style and y'all it just keeps getting worse and worse because it wasn't working and y'all about to see it okay anyway it's pivot our pivot <laughs> oh, wow So we gotta try to finesse a little bit. Save this wash day. We gotta save this wash day because I ain't washing my hair again this week. Probably not next week either. So it ain't defining. It's not wash and go worthy <laughs> at this point with these products. It ain't. So yeah. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Let's see. <laughs> Can I do this here? Cool, let's see how this comes out. <laughs> Is that straight? Yeah. I feel like y'all know what my pivot move is gonna be. If you guessed it right, it is a bun. <laughs> I'm disappointed. Y'all, the products, they smell good, but the jelly is not strong enough to hold the hair in place and the curly Pudding. It ain't strong enough to do that. Not if you got 3B, 3C, 4A, 4B hair. It's not. No. It ain't strong enough for that. It is not. Mmm. Mm -mm. Gotcha. Y'all, looking back at this while I edit, it looks fine on camera for the top half because it's a much looser curl pattern, but underneath where it's tighter, I cannot get that to define to save my life, y'all. It's swelling! My gosh. <laughs> I mean, can I? Have what have? No, 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 no. No, no, no. Stick with the bun. All right, y'all. So something that I did not pay attention to when I bought the products, the jelly. Obviously, it is it is a jelly. I should have that should have been red flag number one. But obviously, jellies they are not gels. They are much thinner, and the bottle does say lightweight. So that is my fault for not paying attention to it. But I had so much faith in that curl pudding, and I was so disappointed that. It did not give me any type of definition in the slightest bit because it is a thick pudding. All right, jelly. Let's see if we can hold some hair down. Okay. There's no hope for the back. Hopefully this can do something to the front. Okay, let's try it. You're not even gonna try to lay the hairs down. Can you uh, hold my edges? Can you? No, no. Yeah, so this is our hair. Um, the only two products that I recommend from this line is the shampoo and conditioner. I really do like those. But guys, I do hope you like this video. Please be sure to subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one.